Hey, I just, I'm just having some fun. So anyways, okay, where is he? Over there, there we go. All right, just go up this street. I, I watched this uh, like old, like surfing movie. Well, I watched it when I was young, but it's old now. All right. Oh yeah, people's homes. Definitely one don't want to do that. Is it this, Sinkichi? Well, yeah, it's pretty obvious. What's the plan? All right. Okay. No need to hold off. Investigation complete. We didn't do squat. Is this the path to the research facility? I believe so, yes. Isn't this kind of dangerous? A sacred festoon? Don't you only see that stuff at shrines and shit? Yeah. What's it doing here? That's interesting. Oh, oh, I got it! They sealed a legendary yokai in there! Maybe you're right on that, Futaba. This is a lab, though. Wouldn't we find zombies or things like that instead? I mean, if we go by the theme on it, yes. Good point. Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> you were kidding, right? Uh, yes. Enough nonsense. This lab's in the real world. Let's get going. Well, yeah, for you, but I'm pretty sure, you know, once we go in the jail. Hey, Sophia. Ooh. Just to be sure, there's no jail here, right? Yeah, we should We should constantly ask her. There is no jail on this island. I think. Interesting. You think? I thought you smelled them or whatever. Yeah, you'd mentioned that you find the jails based on their scent. I am currently detecting zero scents. Unlike Sendai and Sapporo, I cannot sense a jail here. Really? However, there is indeed something odd about this place. I'm getting a bad feeling. Is this where Emma's located? Bad feeling, hmm? Because then, um... Kuan say that they transferred Emma to this place? Ooh, maybe you're picking up somebody with a grudge. Ooh, I'm coming for you. You're wrong for that. <laughs> Cut it out. It's not funny, Futaba. <laughs> Whatever's up there, we need to check it out. We are closed until August 18th due to prior engagements. Oh, that's tomorrow. That's helpful. Well, sure didn't see that one coming. Now we can investigate. Aw, oh, yeah. If no one's really here, we could investigate all we wanted once we infiltrated the place. Hey, hey, hey. Nothing that lands you in jail. <laughs> Criminal trespassing will cop you a felony. Plus, any evidence gained through a criminal act is impermissible in court. Well, yeah. That makes this whole trip pointless. But we're not cops. I mean, we know, but... Sorry. And all we need is just info on where we need to strike next. The sign says the 18th, so we'll just wait till tomorrow. Easier and less illegal. But you're right on that. Once the staff is back, I can start flashing my badge and asking questions. This place is all kinds of shady. So I'm sure I'll turn up plenty of dirt with enough poking around. Once I've got some evidence, I can announce the start of an official investigation. And at that point, we confiscate whatever we need. I see. That's quite the tactical approach. I mean, you know, he is the police. Ooh, check out the skills of Zenkichi. Private eye. Yeah, I'm in public security. <laughs> if we're waiting until tomorrow, that gives us quite some time. What are we gonna do? Wait, you mean we get to party all day on the beach? Oh! <sighs> Could you please focus? He's right. We are on a case, you know. Actually, that's not the worst idea. I know it. Getting too nosy right away could get people suspicious, and we cannot have that. That makes sense. We'd be better off trying to lay low around the tourists for now. Mm-hmm. So... You know what time it is? We get to party? On the beach? Pristine sands? Lady on? <sighs> and to top it off, a barbecue? Well, 
Might as well make the most of it. And to top that, lobster. Oh yeah, I think it's made for lobster, not crabs. We have a winner! That Let's round up the supplies before we venture forth. Cage trap. Okay, I'll search nearby stores. Or rather, nearby store. I was about to say. The only supermarket on the island is back at the port. There's not much to uh, look around for. And here we are. This spot just screams, Beach Party! Yeah? The water is mesmerizing. It almost looks dreamlike. Alright, let's set up camp. Okay. Wait, is he coming? Time! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, wait for us, dude! Hold on! You haven't put on sunscreen! Hey, 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 can't you kids at least... Dave. I mean, you have a daughter. Jeez, those loud ass brats. Loosen your ties, Akichi. Don't be stupid. <laughs> check a few things on the camera. You go have. Fun. Yeah, I figured. It kind of feel weird. Well, I mean, yeah, I kind of would. People will be suspicious of anyone with such a sour look on their face, Akichi. You're gonna act like a tourist, at least fake having fun. That's true. Why not try relaxing for once? Remaining on edge all the time can't be good for you. You can't beat this opportunity, Senkichi-san. <laughs> Are you really gonna let the little lady down, Senkichi? The little lady? <sighs> fine, fine. I'll take a break. Alright! But just a short one, you hear me? I mean, Senkichi, what's the point, you know? <laughs> you don't seem too bothered at all over it. Shut up! Take me with you. This will be my first time in the ocean. Oh, I'll have to be careful, but all right. Smartphones are totally waterproof nowadays. What? Please? I know this phone can go underwater. What? I just checked again. Oh, you wanted to go. Okay, I understand. I'll be your tour guide. Oh, tour yeah. guide. We're all going wild today. Don't say that, Morgana. Ooh, another free bond. I like to see that. Oh! Oh! Huh? Oh, hey! Oh, man. The water's so clear. Wh Whoa! Whoa. Okay, now is the friggin' death! <laughs> this is new? Hey, guys! <laughs> you gotta see these fish! Everybody's so stylish. Wow! Nah. Not your favorite area. <laughs> Uh, Yusuke? Come on now. Yeah, get to show her! Whoa. <laughs> oh, that's creative. I love this. <laughs> Voila, you're beautiful. Hey! Whoa. Well, Whoa. It's some detailed work. I saw they oh, added some stuff. <laughs> Damn, kids! Get back here! You're all under arrest! Now, this is how you hang out. This is how you have a good time, Zinkichi. Ooh. Well, I mean, I guess we can do some stuff. My phone's buzzing. Don't tell me. Got a sec? All right. Later. Is this an opportunity to choose? Okay. Uh, Makoto first then. Well, actually, let me see. Yo. Are those, um, I feel like the stars is representing something on the game, actually. So many fish. Oh, I'm glad I got to show it to her. Yeah, we did. Actually, I was thinking about that. Oh, really? Yeah, it's when we first came up with the name Oracle. I won't forget it either, actually. <sighs> Alright. Now then. What did... Wait, I'm going to the wrong... Wait, dang, Morgana? What the heck? Why are you all the way over here? 
Oh shoot, okay, we doing that later. We doing that later. Uh, let's make sure... Sandy Beach. Sea glass. Oh, we can get treasure here? Wait, Yusuke, dang, they're covering up Yusuke's icon. Hey. What, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Makoto? Nah, I need to, I need to get a... Sui Ka Kawari? Oh! That sounds fun! Right. Well, um... Okay! <laughs> Neither did I, though, but to be frank, you know, I tried to avoid the beast like the plague. One watermelon and, yep, a whacking mm. stick. It's okay. We, we got this. We got this. Warm up in the jail. Um. Okay. Oh, we got a request. Nah, hang on. 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 I just need to... That's nice. They both are, actually. Yeah, they both are. Sheesh. Uh, that reminds me, we still have on. Is something new over here? Hmm. Oh no, it's just a nice view. Yeah, it it is one way or another. Hmm. This is the request. You're already working on this one. You're accepting this request. Defeat Jack Frost with Queen. Okay. Time to get to work. Shouldn't be too hard. Um, we got Ryuji and Zenkichi over here. <laughs> Hilarious Venus. You mean like a flytrap? Uh oh, he was. They were making her him to be up. To be the goddess Venus. Damn it. I see that. Uh, it was all Yusuke's idea. That's true. That's true. Did you have something to say? Whoa! Okay! Really? Good to know. Marine rental house. Interesting. I might want to book this on the places to go one day. Drink stand. Ooh. Okay, now what's up? I was about to say. I knew you were waiting for me, bro. All right. And let's get some. Ooh, 100 to 1. Well, after what Zenkichi gave us, why not spend this money? And then on. Oh, really? Oh, well, that's nice. Yeah, sure, I'll take it. Thanks. While we're here, I did go back. They did change the Dagum Walk cycle of on. Everybody else, because I, when I was looking for the footage of uh, Kaneshiro's palace with the money, there was a time where I think where we all walked, and we all walked so normal. Like, there's no, it's just practical, you know? We just run. And now the developer's like, nah, if we doing this, we doing this. So. Anyways, this was, uh, I feel full after this. Okay. Anyways, looks like we need to go back to the RV. So, let us go. Okay, let's start the mission. <laughs> start, th so you're saying it now. Oh yeah, Morgana's kind of busy. Whoa, nah, 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 nah. Not, not too shabby. Not too shabby. Okay. Um, let's go. Oh, here we go. 
Happen to be on the right place already. Oh, and that was it. Ten was there. Well, okay, yeah, so while I'm here, Makoto's it was pretty much, I think, how everybody's was, but even so, it. Nah, I think hers. Oh, it was. It was not like this, more up or bright. Like, Haru's has a, a style about it, you know, like she's got a heavy weapon. I've seen that happen in many um, anime. Ryuji is also cool, you know. I, I, they're very stylized, right? I like a lot of them. Just saying. When it comes to. Like. That wasn't a thing, and of course, Sophia wasn't a thing, though I don't need to. I mean, obviously. Yeah. No. Wait, do I do what? I mean, heck, I don't even think I run the same. I mean, with the cape flapping and everything. Well, it's not a cape, but you know. What would you call that? I actually don't know the technical term. Anyways, <laughs> let's head out. Alright. Request complete. All right. Speaking of which, yeah, I was about to say she gonna just use her fists. Uh, Ooh. all right. Oh well, thank <laughs> you. Count your spins. Is she literally gonna let me know when she's ready, or is that just another time where of um, you know I possibly missed out on something, or not missed out, but you know? Cause I feel like I just unlock an event, you know? Hey. Yeah. That's true. I see. <laughs> Why you gotta say it like that? Hopefully, still. Full in touch. <laughs> well, all right. Well, that's true. Cannot wait. Yeah, we should. <laughs> Hopefully, it won't. Hey. Hey. So I don't. I guess. It is just like there are no events. I I wait till people responded on Ryuji's because I'm about to upload that episode tomorrow. But I don't I'm having fun and I don't want to stop. I need to record as much as I possibly can. So okay, I guess I'm dealing with Morgana first. Thoughts and Kichi told me though. Here's what I found. There's no additional requests, so. Okay. Let's see. Any bond? Oh shoot! You know what we gotta do? Well, there's two things I could do. And ladies and gentlemen, once again, hey, let's not waste any time. we've returned to where it all began. Whoa! A treasure chest. What's this guy? I see a weapon for you, Ske. Well then, oh yeah, that's a lot better than what he's got. All right, all right, let's see. Lightning wind, though he absorbed nuclear. Let's grab Yusuke then. Ooh, he did? When does this happen? Oh, he got Speedmaster. Me and damage to an area foes with. Oh, well. All right. All right. Oh, Ryuji also got a new skill. Uh, medium electric. All right. Oh, 
Okay. When did I get hit? Wait, technical? How much damage does this do? Okay. We're leaving. Not now. Alright. Well, that was beneficial. And now, we'll see what we got here. Morgana's found some sort of sign. Probably. All right. No entry beyond this point? Uh, I wonder what for. I admit, it only contributes to the mysterious vibe here. Yeah. Oh, looks like a dare to me. Come on, who's willing to go the farthest past it? Are you sure? Nope, this is the end of the line. Yeah. There's an Utaki down that way. See, there, on the sign? What's in Utaki? That's what I was wondering. Basically, it's a land that's been considered holy since the Ryukyu era. Oh. People used to believe the gods lived there, or at least came to work there. Locals still revere the places, even today. Going down there for a laugh could get you in real trouble. Makes sense. Oh, I've never heard of that stuff here. I'm surprised you know all that. Oh, you gotta be informed. Well, Investigation 101 says to know your territory. Yeah. Feel free to keep buttering me up, though. Does that mean there are Ryukyu era customs still being practiced today? Yep. Reverence of the incomprehensible oh. is ingrained deep in human consciousness. And that's how they hide the lab, because no one's ever gonna dare to go past that point. Well, I'm sure you have no interest in pissing off a god today. Let's all listen to the sign and get out of here. Is it similar to that gate? No, those festoons work differently. But now that you mention it, it is kind of strange. Mm-hmm. I checked online for any relevant information, but this place does not appear to have any real significance. The other subjects here are far more interesting, such as the shape of the coastline, the sounds of the waves crashing, and the oceanic life form. Makes sense. A person's values can affect what makes an impact on them. That is true, though. It might be insignificant to you, but to others, this place may be very sacred. It depends on my values. Yusuke! My apologies. Well, his values spoke very clearly right there. Inari stomach. Right on time, as always. Well, I'm starving too. I bet we all worked up an appetite out there. Should we finally kick off our long-awaited barbecue? Let's do it. Barbecue time! Uh, hell yeah! For an Okinawan meat festival. Don't forget the curry. We gotta make some tropical edition LeBlanc curry. <laughs> you got it. Um, uh, that's not exactly barbecue food. Also, didn't you already have curry on the ferry? Hmm. I accept your challenge. Curry will be a perfect complement to the searing white sands of this tropical paradise. We have been having curry quite often. That makes no sense at all. Seriously, what is with you two and curry? What's up? Yeah, what's up? Thank you for earlier, when you gave me the underwater tour. Oh, no prob. It was a fascinating experience, and something no AI could ever do on their own. Which means hopefully you're involving in something of your own. I guess you could say it made my heart feel full. Mm-hmm. Although, I don't have a heart. I doubt that. Yeah, you do have one. It's a simple fact. There is no need to attempt to spare the feelings I lack. But you have feelings. I am still going to try to understand what feelings are, though. I came to that realization when I first stared out at the sea. For example, being with you and the other Phantom Thieves. It's quite fun. Yes, fun. Did I get that right? I think that's perfect. That's right. I got it. I understand another emotion. OK. Though, make no mistake, I am paying attention to the fact that she's saying she's more memorizing things. And this might be just a response she has predetermined instead of actually feeling it. But then she sings! Hey, pick up the pace! We got a whole lot of cooking! 
walking ahead of us. Yeah, and I guess I gotta do a bunch of it. Ooh. Oh, man. Yo, Zakichi! So good. How you gonna be with us in a suit, man? Hey! You saw me about to grab that piece. The curry is divine as always. And with these leftovers, we're sure to dine on curry udon tomorrow. Let's ignore the fact that you're already planning tomorrow's dinner. Why not add deep fried tofu for Inari curry udon? Wow. We've been eating nothing but the most delicious food since this trip began. Well, I'd hope. Traveling makes it a lot easier to lose track of one's diet. I should be more careful. I think you'll be fine. Huh? But you're so toned, Mm-hmm. Right? Oh, yeah. You look like a model. Oh, stop. I know you were just trying to flatter me, but there is an actual model here. Don't embarrass me like that. I'll admit, yeah, sure, but that's... I, I said what I said, all right? I mean, who cares if you've packed on a few extra pounds? Bruh. Your punch is some extra oomph. Bruh. Want to test your theory? I'm about to say. No, please, I don't... Hmm. What's up? I was thinking about it, like, wouldn't the workers still be on the island, you know? Should, are they look like locals? In fact, it went up from 200 to 1,000? Who's to say that's not factory workers? What is it, Zinkichi? Upset stomach? I'm mad at myself for not thinking about that. Hmm? Oh. Nah. I mean, I did, but... Something bothering you? It's probably nothing. Let's wrap up. We gotta wake up early tomorrow. Okay. Hey guys, something's up. Mm-hmm. Yeah? What's that? Keep it down and listen. Okay. I think... Whoa. Okay, I was about to say, we didn't, we're about to have a scene, are we? Because we could... That'd be the end for... Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Um Are they all they all being possessed by Emma? Okay. Does Futaba have her laptop? Oh no, I guess he's just looking for people. And no one's there. What? Hey! It's empty! It can't be far! Yo! Knock who on even more yeah, sus. Oh, they're filing hollow ground. Find them. We'll make an offering out of them. Find them. An offering? Couldn't have gotten far. Spread out. Come on. They can't. Come on. Find them. Oh, thank goodness for Zinkichi. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, bro. Kuan is acting very slothful right now. If she's our enemy, we've officially lost. We should just pack up. Go home and go in our beds and get in the penal position. <laughs> she, she heard everything. Because if she's in charge, it would be easy for her to just put a hit on us. And then, boom, bye bye, Phantom Thieves. Dude, what the hell is going on? Those guys are effing nuts. Hey, there's a secret lab that I found about. Why don't you guys go check it out and die? Uh, no kidding. If Zenkichi hadn't picked up on what was about to happen... Like I said, that would be the end of the Phantom Thieves! He said something about defiling hollow ground. What's that supposed to mean? Well, Zenkichi told us about it before, but I'm thinking their perceptions are... Uh, they're very skewed right now. The lab? I see. That could be it. Remember that straw festoon we saw on the entrance? That's right. We saw it, then proceeded further anyway. Oh! Hang on, hang on. 
What's so friggin' hollow about some lab? And even if it is hollowed, that doesn't explain how they're acting at all. Mm -hmm. They look like they want to kill us. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter how we look at it, these people have lost their minds. They have. Wait, could this be... Emma. Yep. Some desires were taken. And that would mean there's a monarch somewhere around here, yeah? But Sophia said she can't smell a jail here. Well, if Emma's masking them, that's possible. Correct. I cannot smell any jails here. However, you did also say you got a bad feeling from this place. Considering our current situation, I can only assume it's due to a changing of their hearts. Yeah. But nobody tried to attack us until just now. Perhaps there really is something on this island. Something even Sophia can't detect. What do we do now? Who we'll catch us if we just stay here? Yeah, I was about to say, let's go to the lab. Is that a good idea? Won't there already be brainwashed locals there? Actually, it might be smarter than it seems. What do you mean, Gramps? It's pretty obvious, based on how they treat that place, there's something fishy there. Mm -hmm. No matter where we go on this island, they'd catch us eventually. Why not strike at the heart of the matter right away? And if there's a way we can get in the jail from there, then that will be sick. Actually, yeah, we should have just went in the jails, to be honest. By heart of the matter, do you mean a jail? However, there is no jail. Sure, there's no jail, but I bet we'll at least find something in their holy land. I mean, it could be a palace. Sure sounds like a better plan than waiting in the bushes until they find us, right? Zenkichi, are you armed? Just just asking, you know, we... <laughs> oh, no, we don't want to kill them. They're victims. Though they're trying to kill us. And yes, it does. I got to agree. Okay, let's head for the lab. All right. Wait, how are we getting there without getting spotted? <laughs> what are you asking me for? Aren't you guys the phantom thieves? Well, those abilities are only relevant in the cognitive world. Very true. You just gotta go with the flow. Follow my lead. And keep your voices down. Alright. We should at least have that part down. You would think. Yeah, you would think the Phantom Thieves are the ones who get listened on to the most. How is that possible? That moment when I was just talking, you know, I was just being funny. And lo and behold, what I was speaking might have actually happened. Kuan is either the biggest red herring or the epic mastermind. Because no matter how I look at it, you know, from the outside looking in, too many things make sense. The first time she tells us some info happens to lead us to this death trap that would completely wash our hands of ever plotting to eliminate us and it's also some place we would most likely be interested in because it's supposed to have been dealing with Emma it's literally like the perfect place but then on the flip side it also could have been Kuan legitimately trying to be helpful but too many things like I wonder how'd she get this info that Sophia couldn't even find out about the lab and I'd like to point out that the only reason we're alive right now is because of Zinkichi, a cop, someone she had no knowledge of because he wasn't with us when we were talking to Kuan. And again, if she had told us other things leading up to this, then that'd be one thing. But this is the first thing she tells us. And this might have nothing to do with it, but it was coincidentally when we were talking about suspects. We only listed one, and then we got a phone call from her interrupting our conversation. And even if she isn't our target, we still came to a death trap based on her words. That part is fact. Granted, we're the Phantom Thieves, and we probably would have wanted to deal with this eventually, but still, the sus meter's gone up. But anyways, for the question of the day, I'm going to ask you all, how would you rank everyone's swimsuit from your most favorite to your least favorite? Because we got some different ones from the first time in the first Persona 5 game. So, I am curious to see what you all think. So with that being said, please post your thoughts down in the comments below. And I will see you all next time.